You're watching Middle Georgia Pride, only on 41 NBC News at 6. Continuing our Middle Georgia Pride series, we introduce you to someone who's made a difference in the lives of young people in Montezuma, and all through music. 41 NBC's Rachel Scher sat down with Dr. Norman Carter. And that's one thing that Dr. Carter has always taught his students. You're not limited to just the four walls inside Macon County High School, but that you can go far and beyond. He's one of the 80% of students in Macon County considered disadvantaged by the Georgia Department of Education, and his chorus teacher is using music to help. That's, that's why I like music, because it's, it's a universal language and therefore it touches everybody uh, regardless of uh, ethnicity, race, color, or creed. He says the heritage of African culture is rooted in rhythm and drums, and in a school system where 82% of the kids are African American, finding a way to connect with them is important. The valley low, wherever I go. I ask him, what, what's their favorite song? I take that song, and then I take subject matter, and then I combine it and orchestrate it so that the learning at atmosphere will be, you know, motivational for them. A decline in the number of dropouts at Macon County High School is also evidence that programs like these and dedicated teachers like him can keep children wanting to learn. And so I believe if we had more teachers like Dr. Carter that were not just in the music classroom, but in your social studies and your science classes, that we can find a motivation on that I'm not limited to just this area. And you have some that will fall by the wayside, unfortunately, but that's where we come in as educators. We have to be, uh, use all the tactics and techniques that we can so that we can try and salvage all our kids. He's one teacher using music to motivate as his students redefine all odds. I plan on attending Fisk University in Nashville, Tennessee. My freshman year, I plan on becoming a Jubilee singer um, and majoring in biology with a minor in music. Reporting in Macon County, Rachel Scher for 41 NBC News. And Dr. Carter just recently received his doctorate degree in music. He says he hopes it shows his students that no matter how old you are, you never stop learning.